Nigerian pastor and singer Nathaniel Bassi has filed a petition against the internet users who allegedly accused him of being the biological father of Messi Chungwo's son. Messi Chungwo, who is a famous Nigerian singer that is married to Pastor Blessed, has been trending on the internet with her family ever since she revealed the face of her unborn child with her husband pastor blessed this revelation has triggered a lot of reaction on the internet which has led to nathaniel bassi filing a petition because some internet users were alleging that he is actually the child's biological father while a lot were saying that there is a striking resemblance between nathaniel bassi and the son of message before we go into the full story you're going to watch the petition by the legal team of Nathaniel Bassi, while we narrate everything that happens that got us here. But before then, hello, beautiful people. This is Quick View Spot, your Africa Star Room with celebrity stories that you would love to watch. Like the video, subscribe to our channel, and follow us across social media to stay updated with all the latest celebrity stories. My name is Peter Abraham from Fortress Link Law Partners, and uh, with me is uh, Barista. Uche Matthew, also from Fortress Link Club Partners, and Barrister Anto Abia with us. We went to the authorities to submit a petition uh, on behalf of our client, Pastor Nathaniel Bassi. Uh, the petition is against one Mr. Okon Okoronko AGK, Mr. Kingsley Ibe and two others. Let's also educate our people. Um, you cannot catch crews with someone's heart and reputation. In fact, the law does not understand what is a crews in the sense that you are criminally defaming someone and you cannot hide behind a camera to say what you were doing was a cruise. Because if it was a cruise, you would have clearly made it known a cruise. But in this instance, they were very categorical in their statements. Some of one of them even posted a picture of our client at the Basi and said, this is the real father of the baby. So in this instance, this person has made a categorical statement which is in violation of what the law stands for. So in this particular instance, all we have just simply said is that let the police investigate this matter. Our police officers, they know the law. They know what the criminal code talks about and defam criminal defamation in section 373 and 375. They know what, what the criminal cyber crimes act of 2015 talks about. So you will look at this act, you will see that these guys, these persons have gone beyond the law. And what we are asking the police to do is this. We have brought our petition. We have attached our evidence. It is clear for everyone to see. Reacting to this, a lot of people are so happy with what Nathaniel Bassi did. Like, because it was so obvious that this is so defamatory. And guys, you won't even believe it. It was as serious as someone had to even make a video asking them to send the video to Messi Chungwo's husband alleging that Nathaniel Bassi is actually the real father and here is the video too Messi Chungwo's husband go and do DNA on that your son before it becomes too late Messi Chungwo's husband you guys should pass this message across to him go and do that your son DNA before it becomes late I don't want to hear judgment or justice for this person or this person that you have a somebody's child go and do DNA test I don't know what Nathaniel Bassi's face is doing on your son's face that your son will resemble you he will resemble Mr. Chingo what is concerned your son with Nathaniel Bassi you guys will see the pictures of this guy on this video or go, go and go and search for the picture you see that this boy does not even resemble Nathaniel um, uh, Mr. Chingo's back if you don't do DNA now, you will end up training another man child at this world. I'm passing this message across to Mercy Chimo, the gospel artist. I'm passing this message to her husband and him and herself. I want you guys to share this video. So Mercy Chimo husband will see this video. Now there's something I want to tell you guys. Stay tuned. Now she she surfaced her son face yesterday on the internet. Everybody saw it that saw it. But if you can tell yourself the truth, would that baby resemble? That baby resemble Nathaniel Bassi. Blessed from some to blah blah blah, two husband, go and do DNA of that child. Go, if you don't do DNA for that child, 18 years, I don't want to hear justice for yourself that you are betraying on that man's child right on time. That baby really resemble uh, Nathaniel Bassi. 
If if you're a true Nigerian, look at that picture. You see this picture on this video. Look at that picture very well. You will tell me, tell me what the baby not go is not messaging you. You know, Zago messaging was bad. How many years you go carry that in a person's face? The world, the Christian world, is demonic. You see this. You see the entertainment and Christian and, and musical world are demonic. Let's tell ourselves the truth. If blessed does not do DNA now. That means in future they will say you have been training another man child for the past many years. And remember that internet does not forget anything. This video will be here when I ask you, blessed, to go and run DNA test on that child because I'm hundred percent sure. Maybe or maybe not. You are the father of that child because the child does not resemble you. You want to resemble Nathaniel Bassi. I don't know what that Nathaniel Bassi's face is doing in your baby. Every time you see Nathaniel Bassi, I'm a chief minister. Going to um, um churches to minister, maybe the wrong minister finish the wrong minister for bed. Oh, as as Nathaniel Basi minister, our chief minister, the wrong minister for bed. Let us tell ourselves the truth. That is why many 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 men as father so many children that is not their own. Ninety percent of first son or first daughter in Nigeria, ninety percent of them. The the the, the, um, the the man they call their father and not the real father. Let's tell ourselves the truth. Truth be told, every day we are hearing that this person is not a child. This person is telling somebody's child. Now God don't bring this one. Show you. They tell you say this face, that at an embarrassing face. Go and do something. But because you are foolishly in love, you don't want to do something. But I want to remind you that when the thing was supposed on this uh, on this internet, I will still remind you of this video. Just imagine how this girl resembles at an embassy. What is that an embassy they do for a chicken face? At an embassy, I'm a chicken with the program. The same program, I'm better than that to that. So if the minister finishes, they will go or tell the government to start their own. Well, I know that you guys fans will abuse me, say no matter of rubbish. But if you have not seen the picture, go, go and ask for the picture. And you understand what I'm saying? That this child does not belong to Mr. Chief husband. This child belongs to Nathaniel Bassi. Pass this video to them. That this picture, the display, is not Nathaniel Bassi. It's not blessed um, child. That that video is Nathaniel Bassi's son. Share this video so this video will get to them. So you can imagine the extent people would go behind cameras to talk about what is really not their business. The only thing ha that happened there was that message she will reveal the face of her child. Can people just probably appreciate the child and just pass? Do you even have to start talking about this? How is this supposed to be your business? That's what a lot of people are saying on the internet. While a few are also saying that it's good that Natabneo Basi has taken legal actions and if they know they are innocent of all the allegations, that that's actually the right part. But honestly, I don't like the way the thing is going because I feel like the internet should learn to you know, mind their business to some extent that people are involved in this. The people you're talking about also have emotions. Imagine if these people are innocent of all these allegations. Imagine how they will be feeling. They have emotions. They have mental health. They have everything you that is saying the thing is having. How do you expect them to feel? Well, this is just like one out of the other comment. In short, here is another comment from Okonkwa AGK who said, this is the true face of Messi Chimo's child. She was hiding after giving birth. But the truth is that this little baby looks exactly like singer Nathaniel Bassi. Not in anybody one reason me. This child is Nathaniel Bassi's baby. Just maybe there was a secret away match that occurred. Otherwise, how can we make empirical sense of this? Can you imagine? And these comments went on with several others reacting in the same sense. Honestly, I feel like people should please, please learn to talk well. I like, even if you feel that way, do you even have to say it? Well, maybe it's just me. What do you think? Let me know your own opinion in the comments below. But I honestly also feel that Nathaniel Bassi has taken the right step if he's innocent, which I do believe he is, hopefully. But honestly, I just don't like this kind of thing. Messi Chimo would have even said maybe she shouldn't have revealed the face of her child. Well, just tell me your own opinion in the comments below. But I pray that all these things will just go down and people should learn more 
to respect people's um, life, people's family, and know that the people they are attacking are also humans. Thank you for watching and see you in our next video. Don't forget to like and share for more. Bye.